It has been five years since we were last on prehistoric island. In that time, new growth has sprouted from the ground, and never before seen creatures have emerged to feast on this greenery. But so have new predators. <laughs> <coughs> The Nothronychus has been cornered. It appears the hunt has reached its zenith. <laughs> the attacker is a teenage Carnotaurus. His name is Brute. At six meters in length, he is three meters short of his full size. Another Carnotaurus joins him, his sister, Speedy. <sighs> A five meter teenager. She growls at him as she edges towards the carcass. <sighs> Suddenly, a huge roar draws their attention. <laughs> a huge male enters the scene. Their father, Carnage. He growls at Speedy, forcing her to back off. In a pecking order, the larger animals eat first. <laughs> Lastly, a much younger Carnotaurus arrives by Brute's side. <laughs> This is Blue, the younger sister and smallest of the pack. As their father tucks in, his offspring wait patiently. They must wait till their father's hunger has been satisfied before they can move in to feast. Further away, a large dinosaur is dragging food back to the nest. This is Stewie, an adult male Spinosaurus. He has recently been fishing and has caught a freshwater Mosasaur. As he returns, Another Spinosaurus greets him, his mate, Nefertiti. She is a 12 meter subadult. Stewie is three meters bigger. He nudges her gently. As the two reconcile, another male enters the scene. This is Stewie's father, Senior. The three then feast on their Mosasaur dinner. Spinosaurus is a very unique dinosaur, as 95% of its diet is fish and aquatic marine life. But that still doesn't mean it won't snack on smaller dinosaurs if the opportunity presented itself. A few miles away, a group of sauropods are grazing on the trees. It might seem strange to see three unrelated species together, but there is a reason. These three were separated at birth from their nests and have remained together 
since they hatched. There is Nigel, the Nisiosaurus. Alex, the Amargosaurus. And Sam, the Saltosaurus, the oldest and the only female of the trio. Joining them is a male Triceratops. But this isn't just any Triceratops. It's Todd. Over the past years, he has grown into a seven meter subadult. Though he may have one eye, it still hasn't affected him growing up. Suddenly, a large group of dinosaurs runs out of the forest in terror. The quartet are startled. Something big is coming. Sauropods retreat mm. as Todd stands his ground. <laughs> An old enemy has returned. Malachite is back. <laughs> 